Greetings, uh, JFAN members and supporters. Uh, my name is Mike Barkley. I'm the CEO of Kind Snacks, and I'm a graduate of St. Ignatius High School in Cleveland, Ohio, and thus my association with JFAN. I'm reaching out to you uh, today to remind you, if you already know, or to invite you, if you don't, that one week from today, Wednesday, May 27th, we'll be having our first ever JFAN digital luncheon. Uh, it'll be at 12.30 uh, on Wednesday the 27th, and if you haven't done so already, you can go to jfanusa.org to register. It'll be a three-person panel, uh, and the theme for our panel will be Ignatius's vision of community. Uh, why community? Well, we all know that community is really important in general. Uh, in the human race, no man or woman is an island. We are better together. And whether you're talking your family, we're talking about our friends, or we're talking about our faith, our parish community, the Society of Jesus, or the broader Catholic Church, the whole is greater than the sum of its parts. And community is also intensely personal. I know that my association with JFAN and with St. Ignatius High School is really important to me. Uh, whether it be weekly or even daily, uh, texts and Zoom with my friends from Ignatius, or going back to Cleveland every year for a loyal club event, or for our annual uh, Ignatius alumni retreat that I have the pleasure of going to every year with my father, uh, Ignatius class of 53. Um, community is really what keeps us connected, keeps us supported, and helps us grow together. But unfortunately, uh, all of our sense of community is being threatened right now by a global pandemic and the isolation that comes with quarantine. Uh, and JFAN's certainly not immune to that threat to our sense of community with many live events at JFAN chapters throughout the country being canceled this spring. But we can take consolation in the fact that we're all going through this together as JFAN and broader society. And we can even take consolation and inspiration from Ignatius and his original brand, band of uh, Jesuit brothers who loved each other and had a very strong sense of community, wanted to be together, but they also had one foot on the ground. And when they were called to go to China or Brazil or India to save souls, they dropped everything and they went. Um, months, year long journeys, and they stayed connected by letters that required months or years to get there. So even though they were physically isolated, they always felt that strong sense of community and we need to take consolation and inspiration um, from that. And the good news in this day and age is while our community might be disrupted a little bit, it does not have to be derailed. As a matter of fact, it can even be extended and enhanced through the online communication tools that we now have that our Jesuit forefathers didn't. So that's really the point of next week's uh, digital luncheon, an opportunity us for us to connect, uh, to support one another, and to grow together. So again, I invite you next Wednesday, May 27th, 12.30 p.m. Eastern, a three-person panel, myself, Father Tim Kosecki, and Mary uh, Evelyn Tucker, uh, for a three-person panel on Ignatius' vision of community. If you get a chance, please go to jfanusa.org to register, and I hope to uh, see or hear from you all next week. And in the meantime, be healthy, be safe, and God bless.